Duff's in a narrow 2 1 defeat away at Bromsgrove this afternoon. What's your thoughts? Um, yeah, it was a really tough game. Obviously, away from home. Um, tough two and a half hours to get here. So, just a, a different experience for the players that we're trying to expose them to. Um, and look, it was a tough game. I thought we were obviously the more dominant team with the ball, but we sat in a low block and had to counter attackers. And, and obviously, we played a few. Like you say, it did look like with the large spells the better side. How accurate would you say the score line reflects our performance there? Um, Thoughts in certain parts of the game, we created you know, some decent chances, but not as many as we usually do. And I'm not going to play the pitch, I think the pitch is in good condition. And, uh, yeah, it was just one of those days where a few players were their offense today, which was surprising because we thought we'd give certain players an opportunity uh, to show what they're capable of, they're being patiently waiting. You know, uh, obviously we changed it around a little bit and gave those players opportunity and totally honest, they probably didn't take it. There was a good number of changes, like you said, to the side today. Was that just a case of bearing in mind the remaining pre-season fixtures that are coming thick and fast now? Yeah, well, obviously, uh, there's going to be a game Tuesday against Buxton. Um, certain players have played a lot of minutes over the last you know, 10 days and we, we'll be up at it um, and just thought, Say some players deserve a little bit of a run off they've been saying it really well and um, they've been chomping at the bit, they've been doing well when they've come onto the pitch, um, even though the, the minutes have been limited. So we just thought, yeah, we'll, we'll freshen it up a little bit and give them an opportunity. But like I say, um, yeah, they probably didn't take it. In terms of a familiar face, he's done well throughout pre season. It was another great goal for Kane Drummond to put us in front. He's on fire at the moment, isn't he? Yeah, he you know, Kane's come back in phenomenal uh, condition. Um, the reason thing is he's, he's listened, he um, takes a little ball, but we've said, and he looks a real threat every time he goes out there, he possibly could have another goal. Um, but again, you know, he takes him off because you know, he's played a lot of minutes, and you know, there's other people who uh, sort of need a bit of a top up in minutes, but now it's getting to the point where you know, people are probably just going to be left onto the pitch now, and they're going to have to uh, play the 90 minutes. And, Substitutions will be done for tactic reasons only. I'm sure you feel there's room for improvement in terms of losing that lead two minutes later? Yeah, definitely. Look, you know what? For us, again, it's a poor goal to concede. They've got a corner, we're slow, but out, you know, slow to get back. And it was a mix up, he was on the other box, he played it, and sort of there. Scuffed the shot and he's gone to his man, and then he obviously they definitely after the first and scored. On their point of view, it's probably a good goal. For the last, it's, it's, it's a goal to in terms of the second goal, it was a sublime free kick, but in terms of the build up, do you think that was avoidable at all? Yeah, massively. Obviously, we look at the time to play out, but you know, there's a time and place to play out. So I think we started taking too many touches at the back, uh, and we invited them on to press us really aggressively. And, uh, we made a mistake, I think we, we passed out to the wrong person or the wrong angle. Um, and then we were always fighting to try and get it back. We committed a foul, um, we didn't really get off the foul, but obviously the lads put it in uh, for about 30 yards out. Talking of fouls, Paul Dawson was dismissed 20 minutes later after an off the ball incident. What did you make of that? Um, to be honest, I didn't really see much, much in it. Dorsov's is that type of player where he, he sort of plays just on the edge. Um, you know, I just spoke to all the players and I you know, spoke to Dorsov as well. And it's something that you need to be really mindful of going forward because the, um, the, the team is capable of going on a run of games where they win consecutive games. If you're not in that team, you find it very difficult to get back in it. And obviously that's, that's my job. And you know, the staff's role to get a team, but I've just said, explain it to the players. Don't, don't give anyone uh, a leg up by letting them play in the team.
team, and, you know, getting sent off because she's and as you all know as well, it's, it's a very difficult team to get into because the quality that we have. We mustn't forget though how much we've come on as a team throughout pre-season. It's not all negative by any means. Um, obviously there has been a blip with that this week, but I'm sure there's still plenty to be encouraged by what you've said nonetheless. Oh yeah, it's, look, this season's been unbelievable. Um, playing so much with the players, the way we play. Um, we move the ball about the pitch really, really well. We're always looking to get into the big areas of the pitch where we're creative and dangerous. I think we get in there a lot of times. Um, I think we still need to work on that end product, but I think that's the reason why some of these players are at this level is because the end product needs to be improved. Um, but these are all things that we need to learn. And like you said, look, if you don't get too high, you don't shot from the rooftops and we're getting good results, and, and you don't get too low really, because that's just football. It's booked for the way up next on Tuesday. I'm sure you just want to see improvements there. Yeah, it would be another fantastic game. Um, we played books on last year and we had a good result against them. Um, but look, it would be a totally different game. It's the right way for home. Um, we're just looking for a good performance. But for us to play the way we play with that intensity, um, that desire, that aggression, being on the full foot, and just to show that quality that we know.